Well, the world don't move to the beat of just one drum. What might be right for you may not be right for some. Oh. Hello. Welcome back to Shimagami Tensei Devil Survivor. Name's Vex. Uh, we're going the Amon Eret. <laughs> Jin Kuro, have you made your decision to become Messiah and save mankind? Hell yeah. Let's do it. You have been selected by our Almighty Lord. This glory can be none other than yours. Now, Jin, let us go forth together with him. Oh, well, will that save the world, though? What happens to humanity? <laughs> We're all fucked. <laughs> Kind-hearted Jin, your heart aches with worry for your people, does it not? It is true that not all will be safe, even in a world under his rule. Those who do not repent breaking his teachings will suffer his judgment. But Jin, man has continuously chosen to walk a fool's path. When the unjust kill the just and the righteous shed tears, can all truly be forgiven? Now is when man must awaken and take the path of justice and order, as he was meant to. In order for that to happen, you must become the Messiah and lead humanity. I want to think of let's save the world, baby! Thank you. Your actions are noble and your will is strong. I love Jesus. You can see that in my face. I adore him. He is a beautiful boy. Uh, what do I do now? Well, how do I become Messiah? What is the source of his distress who corrupts man and lures him to self-destruction? It's man himself. Your sagacity astounds me. Verily, that is the truth. It would be best if man could truly stand on his own and choose his own path. But humans are weak and easily led astray. We do not wish that much, that much from fan uh, mankind. Jinn, angels, and demons have fought endlessly since the ancient times to annihilate the other. Even if you lead mankind, the demons will try every way they can to corrupt humanity. However, Jinn, you have the means to subdue them, yes? Ah, uh, the throne of Bell. Correct. Oh, hello, Atsuro. I thought you were asleep. Why did you follow me? W wait, hold on a second. What? We have to win the war for the throne of Bell after all yet? I, I thought that was pretty well established, Atsuro. What? That would be the case. Jin will become the king of Bell and order the demons to obey him, thus protecting man. Oh, you, I thought you were asleep as well. Y'all just decided to follow me for some reason? Okay. Using the power of demons to lead mankind to God? That sounds so crazy. How do you know we can even win against those other bell demons? <laughs> well, we've killed the first two. So, we did everything we could, and we were barely able to keep our death clocks wound. I, I don't know about you, but I think we won very handily against both of them. Be at ease. I will lend you my strength, Elia. Rest your bodies tonight and prepare for the morrow. We shall meet again then. Oh, Amane. She's got Remiel, Yuzu. <laughs> Hello, Mari. Hello, everyone. Here's where you all are. Why are you around? You should be sleeping. Krez. No, wait. Miss Mari? Ah, I've been thinking about a lot of things since then. I've gone around and heard about what you're all trying to do. I want to help you out. Oh, see, I have a comp too. Welcome aboard! Thank you, I'll do my best for you. Hell yeah. We have an army now. An army for Jesus. What that angel was saying sounds a lot like what Keisuke said. Is this the right way? You've chosen this. No matter how it ends, I'll root for you, Kuro. I believed in you, and we've come this far. I regret nothing. Except for what I regret. Good morning, Jin. Today you will become the King of Bell, the King of Demons, but also the Messiah who will lead mankind. Uh, that's right. <laughs> it's like, you will have a lot of responsibility on your shoulder. Yep, that's right. Mm -hmm. Yep, everything's good. I will do anything for my baby Jesus. Be not afraid. His blessing will surely protect us from all misfortune. Now, Jin Kuro, let us go forth that you might be, now, uh, be the new world's Messiah. Uh, what about the deadline? Well, let's begin. I don't care about no deadline. Fuck you. Wait a second. 
Even if Vax really can become the Messiah, what about the final option? Aren't we all going to die at 1800 hours? Just do it all before 1800 hours, Yezio. Be not afraid. I am his messenger, here to prevent that. You're sure? We really don't have to worry about it? We are agents of order. We speak only the truth. We will neither lie nor deceive you, liar. Uh, okay, then let's do it. So, where do we start? If to become the messiah, it is vital that Jinkuro stop calling me by my full name, please. Gains control over all the demons. It makes me feel weird. It's like I'm a part of a cult. In other words, you must win the war for the throne of Bell and ascend as Overlord. <laughs> Hell yeah. Behinds of old gal gal gown. Fuck. It's been a while since I've seen Overlord. Uh, my mind's made up. For you to lead mankind as the Messiah, you will need a foundation of power. Only by bringing the demons defying him to heal can you become the Messiah. To meet the qualifications to become king of value. Yeah, we know. Why are you repeating lines? We already know all of this information. Defeat the other bells, but where are they? Your first task is to defeat Jezebel. No, our first task was to defeat Belder. We did that. We're on our third step. Our third task. <laughs> Shut up. Defeat Jezebel, the demon of Bell, within this girl, Amane. We're going inside Amane. This is not lewd. Why don't you just do it? I can't fight within her. I'm... what? <laughs> Wait a second, you're an angel, aren't you? You're in her body, too. So, um, wouldn't it be fastest if you beat Jezebel yourself? The reason I have revealed myself to you and speak to you now is because you were all chosen as representatives of mankind. I lend you my strength because you attempt to withstand this ordeal by your own strength. You didn't answer anything. In other words, we have to do this no matter what. I did what? Our time is limited. Jezebel is already slowly dominating. Honey soul, but you're in there too. Why don't you help? I'm keeping her in check for now, but I cannot manage it much longer. Soon, Jezebel will gain full control over this body, and Amane's soul will parrot. This is fucking dumb. What? <laughs> How do we defeat it? You have begun to awaken as a. What? <laughs> okay, we're just dropping that <laughs> on our heads. I mean, okay. I guess I can't. I was spoiled a little bit. I know that now he is supposed to be Kane, and I'm able. And there were little hints every now and again. That's like, oh, you're his, you're his brother. Okay, but it's still this is still really dumb. These things together with my assistance will make this possible. Possible. Able? Are you talking about <laughs> She let she like pointed at me and said you're able. Are you blind, Yuzu? <laughs> Abel is the name of one of his blessed children. I will explain further in <laughs> I don't think you need to explain anything about Abel. When you are ready, return to this place. Go, prepare yourselves to battle Jezebel and return to Miyashita Park. You don't need to explain Abel. If you don't know who Abel is, he was killed by his brother, Cain, with a rock. That was the first murder that ever took place. Alright, there's literally nothing we can do. <laughs> Let's go to the devil auction. Hello. Oh, oh right, I forgot. Uh, I unlocked a new... Uh, pl a new auction tier, the occult. It's, uh, that's shitty. That's shitty. That's shitty. These are all really bad. Why? Why? Aren't there, like, that's terrible. But you also get the Mitamas, though, so, and they're, I guess, good. I don't know. I don't fucking know. Let's see our team. Uh, yeah, no, it's probably okay. I mean, I have Mari now. She's under level. I'm over level. I'm sorry. I'm dumb. Also, KSK's here. He's not been much use at all. Cool. Decent, I guess. Uh, let's go. You've returned. You are prepared for battle then. I will send each of your minds into Amane. But first, I will keep my promise to you. 
Is this about Abel? Indeed, I will tell you now of Abel, his beloved child. Jinkuro, you are his child, and you are also capable of becoming Overlord. I'm special. <laughs> but I'm no one special. That is very true. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. Anybody could have just... I, I can't really say anybody. Can you? They had to know Anawia, so... I mean, this could have also been Atsuro, I guess, but uh, that's very true. You are both special and not. Uh, shall I, it's not how it works. I shall explain why. There once were two brothers. The elder's name was Cain, and the younger's was Abel. These brothers were at the center of the first tragedy in human history. Why did it happen? <laughs> it is not easy for man to grasp his will. This child of sorrow, Abel, was the first human killed by his fellow man. Though he was his child, he was murdered by Cain's hand, his own brother. Cain killed him. <laughs> Indeed, Cain, Abel's killer, became the first murderer and the will forever live in solitude. Abel killed before awakening as his child continues to be reincarnated as a human. His essence has been inherited by many. Do you understand? <laughs> no. One Cain, but many Abels. This is dumb. That is correct. Abel's essence has faded over time, yet it still exists within many humans. Many in this world possess Abel's essence. You are one of them. It is not rare. But you defeated two bells, and thus has Abel's dormant power begun to awaken. Though you are his child, you are now the sole human capable of becoming the king of Bell. Is that why I was chosen? Abel has the power of Bell? Yes, that is what allowed you to absorb the power from the demons of Bell. Only you can lead mankind to its true calling in your ca capacity as his agent. Belial called him Bell of the Human World, so what's that? that? What? So that's what that meant. My God. But I have digressed long enough. Let us begin. Defeat Jezebel, who lurks in Amane's mind, and free this girl's soul. How do we do that? In, in, in every fucking like SMT game or Persona game, there's always a fight for somebody's soul. <laughs> Guess what this episode's going to be called? With Abel's dormant power and the comp to control the flow of thoughts, you may enter Imane's soul to engage Jezebel. Yep, that makes sense. Keep a firm grasp on yourself. Do not allow demons to swallow your heart. If they do, your fate will be the same as if they had defeated you in this world. If you die in her mind, you die in real life. What? Imane's soul is already in the process of being dominated by Jezebel. You already said that. It is possible that her soul may oppose you. Please be very careful. Uh, can we snap her out of it? Correct. You must awaken Amane's consciousness. If that is done, she will undoubtedly lend you her strength in battle. Amane's consciousness? Okay, I got it. If your souls fall to evil, you will never again be able to return to this world. You just said that. I will help as well, but you must be extremely vigilant. Now go. May his divine protection be with you. This game has a, a chronic case of repeating itself. And I understand that I do as well. Is this the inside of Amane's soul? I mean, I would assume so. You have a Sakura tree right behind you, so... Wow, a field of flowers. Look how pretty it is. Is this really inside someone's soul? I can move, and things here feel solid, too. Huh, it's not as different from reality as I had thought. But I'm not looking at your and Vex's actual bodies, right? Uh, I think so, yeah. Well, it doesn't feel like it. It's pretty bizarre, isn't it? Hey, it's just our souls here, right? If we lose to Jezebel and our souls don't return, what happens to our bodies? It, they drop. They'll be left soulless. Erg. Let's work quickly so that doesn't happen. Hmm? Wait, isn't that Amane over there? Over there? Look, it's Amane. Hey, Amane! Amane, can't you hear me? Who goes there? That voice, where's it coming from? Who dares to track mud through another soul? What's wrong with Amane? <laughs> Midori, shut up. I don't know what this voice I'm doing for Jezebel is. Just go with it. 
Oh, I thought we were going to get a cutscene, but nah. Just everything just turns into lava. What is this place? What happened to the flower field? Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Uh, now, I've seen the Maki Dick Geiger thing. This, uh, this probably takes the cake over that. Yeah. Alrighty then. They're so rude, aren't they, Amane? So that's Jezebel. Hold on. I'm coming to hold on. I'm coming to save you. <laughs> I thought I was just gonna say, hold on. Wait, this is weird. To save her? No one here needs any saving. See? Look how you trouble Amane. You should all die for this. Ah, rude. Don't summon your starfish. How's that one surviving? It's in the lava. You're stupid. <laughs> Absolutely savage. No one here is dying. Why are you here? I guess to heal people. Oh god, what can we crack? Life Surge, Mabufudine, Judgment, Haves Foe, HP, all. Wow. Why can't I get that? Magic, of course. If only I went with the magic build, instead of my amazing, super good punching skills. She can't even get Judgment. She can, though. <laughs> She's better. <laughs> oh my god. That'd actually be pretty decent. I would assume Jezebel has it. Oh, I was right. Got a level 59. So you have no weaknesses. I can't use... Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> That's not good. Fuck. Okay. Well, that's good. What do you have? For a second, hold on. Judgment, Mirage 9, Holy Dance, Dragon Eye, Mana Aid, Ice Repel, Hot Flower. That's a thing. So you don't have any ice moves, which is good. You have fire, so... I mean, of course, you have fire. Everybody has fire. It's the best skill. I ain't gonna fucking do anything. Let's just kill the bitch. Ah, uh, you here, I guess. You... Here, I guess. You can hit for nothing because you have <laughs> Um, I guess you can just punch her. You can go like maybe with Atsuro. And then you. Uh, oh, you have a Kate. She has electric. <laughs> Wait, she does. She has a thing against electric, doesn't she? I don't think she does, though. I didn't want that cursor mode. That's what I want. Reflects electricity. So this is just this is a physical brawl, everybody. I hope you're ready for some punching. Oh, you don't even have like chaos wave. That's fine. You have evil wave though. Okay, so we'll just like pincer attack, I guess. Hold on, let's look at it. Because there's no way we're going to be able to walk into the lava, like at all, really. I say we go for Amane, obviously. Hell, she has Megiddo, which is really good. Okay. And no, and yeah, Dekarabia, that one at least has strength, okay. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Just do a little reconnaissance, I guess. Alright. Let's wing it, see how things go. Come on, Amane, don't give in to a demon like this, it's your soul. <laughs> I don't think yelling at her is doing anything. Don't you know, my roots are planted firmly inside of Amane, so that's lewd. It's deep within... I, yeah, there's no way we're going to be able to, like, walk on that lava without taking damage. So let's, like, move here, I guess. Okay. 
I want Yuzu to follow Atsuro. I don't even know what I can do. I get over here and then get over here, I guess. But I, it makes more sense to just pile on everything. <laughs> Everyone just do a pile on. Right? That's how this game is. There's no actual strategy, you just pile everybody on each other. Heal when you need to. I can't go anywhere because I'm blocking the way, I guess? Okay, the Dekarabias are being nice. Just like, hey guys, how you doing? Why are you here? Yeah, this is riveting. We're doing it. It's happening. I do not have... Okay, what do you have? You're fine. Let's move up to here. It's like, now you activate. Now I'm in the proper area. I could fire dance, but that would be dumb. I could ice dance. That would be not dumb. Fuck your shield all, dude. Screw your Zeodyne. Okay, well. Kukulane is fucked. <laughs> Can't use him anymore for magic. What'd you block? Can you stop picking on my poor boy? He didn't do anything to you. That was very professional, mate. I did it. Ah, uh, nah. Oh, no, that one's got Evil Wave. <laughs> Not Calibre. <laughs> oh, Kukulain's dead. And I'm frozen. Yay. That was a good turn, everybody. Yeah. Yeah, you have the Amorita. Not, no. You have the... Recarm, that's what I wanted. Yeah! Okay. Now, if only you could move really well. That would help so much. Quick! Atsuro, get in the way! I could... Elect Dance. I can do fire moves. That'll help. Cool. Everybody fucking dead, maybe. Almost. <laughs> you did it. Shield all really came in handy, didn't it? Didn't it? You can actually affection me. Yeah, I said... Yeah, I said it. No, what? Oh, yeah. So don't stand in the fire. Gotcha. You also have Recarm. You can't attack, though. We're coming for you, Amane. Don't you worry. I just have to take care of this starry boy. I could just attack. Deathbound. Berserk. Just attack. Uh, you can just attack. Deathbound. Do you see how good that is? That's pretty okay. Cool, I've got Magnetite Bound. I don't really need... Well, I could have used it, I guess. Mane. I'm almost there. Don't you worry about a thing. Now I can attack the Dekarabia here. 
Shield all, because that'll help. Ice dance. Ice dance. Ice dance. I can't do this against Jezebel, though. She's such a bitch. I have Pierce, don't I? <laughs> no, not that Pierce. Pierce won't help me, though, right? Doesn't do anything for that. He's still coming, he's still trying. Oh no, I didn't put Pierce on me. Okay. Hey, Amane. You wanna like... Do I ha I can't attack her. So like, what do I do? I also can't stand in the fire. Okay, that does count as attacking her. <laughs> Sorry, I had to a little, do a little thinking. That, uh, I mean, get a little drinky. So, let's just attack her, I guess. Okay, yeah, no, that... That... That is worse than the, the, than the Maki. Okay, yeah. Let's do a Death Bound. And you can do a Berserk. And you can do a power hit. 334 damage. Jesus. And you do a Mirage. And. Ugh. Amane is taking damage. If we don't do something, she's gonna die. Continue your attacks. You must not hesitate. Is that Remiel's voice? As Jezebel suffers, Amane's sense, Amane's sense of self will begin to return to her. But be cautious. You must not harm Amane's soul. Continue to assail Jezebel while guarding Amane's soul. Without me. I kind of, I kind of fucked up, apparently. Uh, yeah, well, let's go ahead and attack this Decorambia. I mean, while we're here, right? Guess just attack the Viv. My Bufu. 482 with a crit. My man. Okay, well, there's that team down. Now we gotta. Now I gotta fix me. Ah, uh, well. That was my bad. I take responsibility. I guess recarm here. It's like, what the fuck happened? You got fucking murked, bruh. I don't know how it happened, but it happened. I guess we can heal me. She's the only one with her recarm, right? No. You have recarm, don't you? Yeah, okay. So this is definitely a fight for those with the Chaos Wave and shit, yeah? That's what I'm getting out of this. It's like you can move over here and then you can recarm my buddy uh, Berserker. And then, uh, oh fuck. Okay, that's a range. Never mind then. Okay, that's kind of bullshit. <laughs> what the fuck? Like, what? <laughs> Wow. 
Why do you have that much range? Why do you get three attacks? I'm stunned. I don't... <laughs> can't stand there, can I? It's like half in the lava. Everybody's going to die. Nice 82. Now all our shields are broken. A holy dance and a Mirage dying. Like, what the fuck? Like, I'm the major damage dealer, like, I can't die. He can, if he wants, I don't fucking care, but... Jesus Christ, that's bullshit. Can I attack her from here? No. And like... I wonder... I doubt I'd be able to hit her from next to Amane. I could try to mute her. That might help. I don't think she'll be able to be muted, though. Imagine if she could be petrified. Just imagine for a second if she could be petrified. <laughs> Box it. Oh, right, she nulls it. So I'm sorry. I'm dumb. I mean, Python wasn't going to do anything anyway, so... Oh, well, there's Python gone. That is bullshit. Oh my god. Why do you get three turns? It's like, hey Jim, did you figure out how to be really annoying with these bosses? Yeah, just give them three turns in a row to do whatever the hell they want. Brilliant. You figured it out, Jim. I'm just waiting. I need my team back. <laughs> I have to do damage though. So that's the that's the part. Right? You only have a Dairahan. Of course you do. So I guess you can do this to me, and then the other one to Kukulain. I fucked up again. I can't retaliate, so cool. Like, I have to keep Yuzu and Midori away from her range enough, right? This is going to be like a, a battle of endurance or some shit. Who do I I don't have anything. I don't have any backups. I have this Decarabia, but it's shitty. I can use parry. That'll help the Mazar. <laughs> I can do this uh, Mothman. Hmm. If I slam a might call. 
Uh, Saki Mitama, good. Yeah, I have, I, mm -hmm. I have two parries. Yeah, that's. I'm disappointed in myself. I, okay, yeah, that's fine. I feel like I'm losing it right now. Or did I not have it in the first place? That's the biggest question of them all that needs answering. Don't mind me, Jezebel, I am just healing myself, because you are a massive cunt. Yeah, I guess just keep her out of range. Midori has not had a turn in a long time. Okay, so I can come here, right? And then I can make Berserker aggravate himself. For a guaranteed crit. <laughs> This'll work. This'll work out just fine, don't worry. See, she's under half right now. Look at that. Look at that. Can you just, like, stop being rude? Oh. No, my conscious. <laughs> I went in too hard. So this is round three. I'm getting a little pissed off at myself. But, you know, you just gotta keep on keeping on. That's all you can do, right? Just keep on doing it. Same way every time. Actually, no, we're not doing it the same way. We're doing this we're doing the pincer attack, but we're not all set up yet, and she's attacking us. So, yay. We're, we got that to deal with. I'm f I'm fed up. I'm fed up with this woman. Demon thing. Tree tentacle monster. I'm done. She needs to die. Of course, Berserker can't get him a hit in. That's like in the lava, yeah. So, like, stand here. So I can't attack her from there. <sighs> I don't know what her range is on this side. I'm going to assume like I need to be far away. Oh, Atsura only has 17 health. Of course. I like this is going to matter at all. Every little bit. Every little bit of damage. I'm getting so pissed off, I'm just like acting irrationally at this point. That I just... I don't know, man. I'm tired. I'm tired of this fight.
Should I just throw Yuzu in there now? Of course she can't actually do that from there, huh? Yeah, go ahead and step in the lava for me. This is dumb. You need to stand there or something. I'm going to hope. Okay, they aren't in range. Just slam three judgments down, or do that. Just completely ruined my fun. Everything is bad. It's just so annoying. Okay, you can move like over here, right? You can't attack or you can come really close. Just one square, and you're right there. Maybe I can get up to there, because she can't attack me from there either. Abaddon can help with the re the the recarms. This is the strat. Now I heal a little bit of Berserker's HP. She can't do anything because we're all out of range. It's beautiful. So if I recarm Atsuro, it's going to have to be for Midori. Or I can bring him over where Yuzu is, but... Why would I do that? Everybody's in tip top shape again. It's like I found your weakness, Jezebel. You have a very specific range. What is your. What's your health at? I don't know how far I can take it. If I just normal attack with everybody, not power hit with Kukulain, 292, 312, and then Berserker just can't get a move in at all. <laughs> of course. Okay, she's now in the yellow. Bring myself back from the dead. Put me here. She still can't hit me from over here, at least. Go Dairahan. And now I want you to move back over here. I'll let Atsuro come back. You can move up to here. I'm just gonna throw myself at her. They've got enough MP to do some more recarms. I hope I can go first. I hope I don't hit too hard. <sighs> That's going to be too much.
Oh, thank Christ. Something different. I've been doing this for an hour now. Oh my god. Everyone. What? I, Jezebel, what's going on? We're killing the parasite. Look what you've done. She's reclaiming her. So be it. I'll draw in her soul again. Well then, okay. Yes. I see. Jezebel has... You guys saved me. I can't allow myself to be bound. Jezebel, I won't be controlled by you. This is my soul. Er... Amane, are you okay? You look like you're in pain. Hmm, I feel faint. She took more of my power than I imagined. Hehehe. He, he, he. Do you think you've escaped? Master Belbereth will be angry if I let you do that. Come, come back to me. I'll possess you again. Oh my god. Be wary. Amane's soul grows weaker every moment. If she is possessed again, she will not have the power to resist. What do you mean? If Mane's soul is possessed again, she'll be, she will belong forever to Jezebel. Your souls, too, will be trapped where you stand. Protect Amane. Can I not? I wasn't ready for this. Like it all. At least I won't die from fire. Mind Amane with Ukano, Mitama, and Cerberus. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's... that's great. <sighs> I assume if I just kill Jezebel, then the Mind Amanes will go away. I'm going to hope that's the case. And so, I'm going to try and do that. But... okay. Plan. Atsuro, summon... Mothman. Right? There's an end your turn. Yuzu. Or Bridget. Whatever one. Revive this guy. And we gotta be snappy with healing and everything. Thyrahan. You if only you had two recarms. I can't attack her. Let's see, what do you got? Strong against oh, that's I can still take out the Ukano Mitamas and Cerberus with her, at the very least. I can do something, maybe. You know? Amabufu, Amabufu. Three hundred and ninety-nine. Yeah, okay. You shouldn't have Holy Dance. Yeah, of course. Hey, it was something. It was something really dumb that I did. Shouldn't have done that. I was being very impatient. You just have Atsura and Mothman, okay. I can attack you from here, can't I? Ah, 
I can't do fire. Fortunate. Do Mabu uh, a Bufu die. Okay, good. At least this side understands how to fight, am I right? Okay, and heal yourself up. You don't have a whole lot of MP, you had like that one heal. Amazing. There's no way this team will be able to take that that one out. There's there's no way. I'm not going to try it. She'll come to me though. That's how it's going to end up happening, isn't it? Yuzu's dead. Just straight up six damage. Amazing. I'm not ready to... <laughs> I'm not ready to be touched yet, please. Don't do this to me. I think... This might be as good as it's going to get. I need to do... I need to do this quick. I just need to go in, right? Just not enough. <sighs> Come on. going to be very stupid. I just need demons. I just need demons at my side. I'm going to be very stupid right now. I don't know what's going to happen after this. I'm banking on everything just dying. So let's see how this works. I can Mazan. Yay, Atsuro got the kill. Congratulations. Oh my god, how incredible. I should have known you were a bell. But even if you take my power, Master Belbrith is ever the king of bell. Ah. Uh, Atsuro is the king. Max felt the power of Jezebel come to rest inside of him. I don't know if that's a good thing. I was an hour and a half just doing the same shit. You feel better? Thank you very much. You've saved me. If I'd stayed like that, my soul would have been soul would have been utterly consumed by Jezebel. Now I'll give you my power. Return to the real world. <laughs> yeah, okay. I can just do that. Don't you worry about it. 
It seems we've all returned safely. Thank you all very much. Yeah, it didn't really feel like the inside of a soul, but I'm glad to have my body back. Alright, Amane. I, I mean, Remy. No, she's clearly Amane right now. I mean, Ramiel, what's next? Ah, can't you tell, Atsuro? It's me, Amane. Yeah, when I'm Remiel, my hair is weird. Remiel's role must have ended when you defeated Jezebel. He's no longer inside of me. That... Can we not say that? What? But did he... Well, great. Now we have no idea what to do next. Don't worry. I'll come with you. After all, I'm the only one who can hear Remiel's voice. Oh, that'll be helpful. Yeah, so I'll help in whatever way I can. Wait a second. Aren't you the Shomunkai, eh, Shomunkai's maiden? Don't you guys worship Belbereth? That's right. My father Kuzuryu and the Shomunkai worship Belbereth, the raging god. By heeding Remiel's words and assisting you, I'll be going against their teachings. But in speaking with Remiel, I've come to know God's love and kindness. The Shomunkai's aim is for man to unite and withstand God's ordeal. It is not incompatible with Remiel's and God's teachings to achieve through, through order. In watching your actions during the lockdown, I have begun to doubt my beliefs. Is using demonic power and causing suffering the right way to withstand God's ordeal? Hmm. Have you made a decision? Yes, I will follow my heart, though it may lead to a schism with my father. So, you're prepared for that too. I hope we don't have to put you through it. That's what the new Smash game should be, not Ultimate, it should be Schism. Thank you, Yuzu. Your consideration is touching. I shall tell you what Remiel said to me. Is that alright? Yeah? Your ultimate objective is Kingsgate Babel. Babel. You will become the King of Bell upon reaching Babel and overcoming the final trial. By taking Babel's power, the King of Bell can lead mankind to, a, to peace as God's messenger. Is it another Baal? You mean like the Tower? Babel is a high-energy data entity lost by the original Bell when God defeated it. According to Remiel, who, he who overcomes it will be able to gain tremendous power. Thus, the final objective in the War of Bell is to gain the vast power within Babel. The summoning server you all seek, it is none other than Babel itself. Wait a sec, that's the server controlling the demon summoning program? Indeed, that is the case. Babel currently sleeps within the server, awaiting the true king, the true, awaiting the true, the king of Bell. Only one worthy of becoming the king can summon and awaken Babel. Where's the server? Belbereth has transferred the summoning server to the demon world. Eventually, this was a move to increase the summoning program's efficiency, but Belbereth's true objective seems to have been summoning Babel. He's using the server as a medium to contain Babel, a high-energy data entity. A medium? But why, a ser why the server? Babel is in the demon world, but it cannot be seen or touched. Belbereth contrived to use the server as a medium to manifest Babel in order to challenge it. The server harnesses the flow of thoughts. Its user can bend to it to his or her will. Belbereth likely decided that it to control and interface with a data entity such as Babel. It would be best to use a device suited for that task. Actually, in the demon world, then Belbereth has Babel? That seems to be the case. Belbereth no doubt transferred the server in order to keep it close by. That's really bad. If Babel accepts Belbereth, he'll become king, right? True enough. But he must not have had the qualifications to be king when he manifested Babel. Babel failed to respond to his challenge, and Belbereth was unable to become king. To gain those qualifications, Belbereth has been absorbing the power of Bell demons. Man, so that's what the war for the throne of Bell is really about. Since the war is ongoing, Belbereth must still lack the proper qualifications, but he has already absorbed many Bells and taken their power. If Babel responds to him, he will undergo the final trial to become the King of Bell. We must return to the server turn it, return the server that was fused with Babel to the human world at once. But to do that, we must first create a connection between the demon world and our own. Ash, how do we do that? The two worlds are separated by a wall of power. The creators of that wall are the fierce gods known as the Four Devas. Uh, four Dark Devas of Destruction. All we have to do is call Gundam Tanaka. The four devas. So those guys are protecting Tokyo from the demon world? 
There's a reason the demon summoning program can work without com complex rituals. We in the Shomenkai weakened the barrier between the human world and the demon world. I used Jezebel's power to defeat one of the devas, thereby destabilizing Tokyo's spiritual condition. The fuck? That must have been Jikoku and Asakusa. Yes. At the time, I thought my father's teachings were the only way to save the world. If only I had been able to hear Emil's words much earlier. So that was why you beat Jikoku. And there are three devas left preventing the demons from encroaching on our world. While they remain standing, we will find ourselves unable to summon forth a server. Our task is to defeat them and create an aperture in the wall. What? Are you saying we have to defeat the devas? But that would be incredibly dangerous. Case K. It has been in incredibly dangerous for a long time now. Are you just waking up? Remiel seems to think so. My own opinion is unchanged. But the spread of the summoning program has led to vast numbers of demons in the city, completely destroying the balance between the worlds. If this continues, it will be only days before the imbalance crushes the human world. This seems to be one reason the angels are watching the lockdown so intently. Then we have no choice. That is correct. Let us head first to Aikokuji. One of the devas seems to be there. Aikokuji. Oh, that's an Ikebukuro. The devas have protected Tokyo for a very long time. Approach them with caution. I'll lend you what little strength I can. Amane joins your party. New demon's up for good. Oh my god. What demon? Oh, Ukano, Mitama, and Cerberus. Yeah, cool. Hooray. Tired. We'll have to go to Aikokuji next time. Thanks for watching.